Hello everybody, good day to you all. Today's one Loki season one episode, episode number one, Glorious Purpose. That was directed by um, Kate I'm here on. And in this episode here we found if takes off takes off right after right right um an Avengers Affinity War? No, end end game? No. Which one was this one? But if it, 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 it feels it feels like where, where, where the last movie takes off and it, and you show Loki what he do we take they take the they take the um the Tesseract and he goes and he goes and he goes away. Picks it right, picks it right from my right from there, and now you got the now you got the the the, 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 the time brew after him, calling him a, a, a variant and trying to get him like back on course, the way he supposed the way he supposed to be. But in, in this in this trailer here, Luke, you find Loki like discovers more about himself, who he is as a person, accepting himself for who he is, and not and also pretty much telling the truth to himself to himself for the first for the first time ever in his life. Because he's seeing what true power actually is, and he doesn't have it. He also seeing what his life would have been if he stayed, if he stayed on course, and how how and how he would have ended, and see how that how that affects him, and how the decisions that he's making to try to make himself make himself glorious or not really make himself glorious at all, it actually to make make other people around him better to be become the heroes. Because because without him, there would be no adventures. So even though he's trying to pump himself up, trying to trying to be like he's better than everybody. All, all, all he, but he realizes that he he does he does a scared, in, um, insecure child, who's who just who just wants love, and he just, he just acting it out to get it. Yeah. And seeing like I mean, he's, he's, like the acting performance from Tom Hillison, from the, from the comedic points to to the touching moments in here was done quite quite well, and that is, and also the whole concept and idea that he that, that he's gonna be after chasing after himself, who, who's another variant of himself from another timeline. That he actually that he, that he, this one is actually pure evil. And he had to, he had to use his like his well his trickstery to be much go after him and stuff like that as well too. So and the and the and the scene between him and Owen Wilson was done perfectly. I think Owen Wilson did a, a great amazing job in here as well too. From his comedic timing to the, to the moments he had with Loki getting to open up and actually re-examine himself. And I did like oh. It was done so well. It was done so well. Like, ugh. For the, for, the, for the first episode, this is how we're starting off, and this thing started off with a bang. Like, wow. Not because the thing is, though, it wasn't, it wasn't a lot of action. Wasn't that nothing really blowing up, anything like that, really. But just the acting performance alone was like this, was, was enough to say, yes. Yes. Like I said, the scene between him and Owen Wilson. Tom Hiddleston and Owen Wilson was just was perfect. Like it was so beautiful. Like wow, they're, they're banter back and forth. The chemistry they have on screen, and you want to see them work together. And the, and the visuals in the movie was done so beautifully. Like for, for, that's when you see the time period when they punch Loki for the first time. Have him move, have him move, have him moving in slow motion while they, while they moving in regular speed was done so well. And then seeing the whole the whole world that that um, that they were in, the whole futuristic um, retro look was like was beautiful. And now, I don't know if they're gonna do do this or not. But but is this how they introduce Kane the Conqueror from from here? Is that, is that gonna introduce Kane? Because a lot of the, a lot of the people the, the people who like or like who's in charge the, uh, the main guys who was in charge the most powerful beings look, look they look like Kane to me. So is, is this how Kane gonna come from? The Kane the Conqueror, maybe I I don't know. But overall, I am in. The the first episode was was amazing. Tom Hillison did a great job here. I, 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 but the thing though, he he always does a great job as Loki. So I'm looking forward to seeing that as well too. And had addition had addition of all all to the cast. It was done beautifully, because it was it, it was funny. It was touching as as well too as as well too, and also made you made you want to look forward to seeing the next episode. So this episode was just perfect. Was pretty much near perfect. So I I'm on board. I'm looking forward to see where where it, come, where it goes next after this. So leave comments down below. Let me know what you thought of this episode of Loki. And if you haven't been watching it, check it out for yourself. Hopefully you're watching, you will enjoy it from watching it too. So give me a channel like, hit the thumbs up, shaboom, and subscribe to my channel and share. I would appreciate it. Also, links down below. Connection to all my social media. You want to follow me there. Also, I, also to, my, to, my, to my online stores where I sell things. You can buy some stuff from my stores, from my shops. I would appreciate it a whole lot. So like I always say, in my dreams of life, I am the Ninja Rabbit. Uh, peace out. Ah, uh, peoples.